Hello, my name is Greg Huff and I'm the Chief Technology Officer for Industry Standard Servers at Hewlett Packard. And I'm Patrick Patla, the General Manager and Vice President of the AMD Opteron Division at AMD. So Pat, at HP we're very excited about the G34 MagniCore products that AMD is coming out with. A lot of innovation there. We're very excited about wrapping those up with our innovations and getting you know joint products out to market for our customers. Why don't you talk a little bit about what AMD has done with these new products? Sure, so if you look at what we've done with the 6100 series processors, we've brought out the first 8-core and 12-core processor for the two-way market and the four-way market at the same time. Then we've gone ahead and take that product set and we've extended a 2P economic pricing strategy where we think it's going to be a great opportunity to grow the market and bring four-way capabilities down to the bulk of the market in the two-way space. So at HP, we're also very excited about this 4P performance at 2P Economics. I think that's going to be especially impactful for virtualization. Why don't you talk a little bit about your views there? Sure. Well, if you look at the, the trends in virtualization and what we knew we wanted to deliver in the market for both the two-way space and the four-way space, we really looked for platform balance. So the ability to have four memory channels off each CPU, the ability to have more resources, and that's where a 12-core product or an 8-core product is going to be great in the virtualization space. Plus, staying in the power envelope and the power efficiency that we know the data center is asking for in their data center planouts, we think we really hit it big for data consolidation. So staying with direct connect memory and four channels per processor, getting all that scalability and balance, that's really helped us a lot in packaging because we were able to take the economic intent that you had of 4P uh, capabilities at 2P kind of platforms and price points and map that into our products as well both with the 585 for rack mount and the 685 for blades which we think will be very innovative because it's actually going to be the densest blade from a compute perspective that we've ever been able to produce and we were still able to uh, fit it in a single full high form factor where we can get eight in one of our C-Class chassis. We've had a lot of innovations over the last couple of years around power management CIA sensors, thermal, energy efficiency, phase shedding, VRDs, etc. We know you guys have done a lot in the new 6100 series around this as well. Perhaps you could describe a little bit of that. Sure. So I mean, we've had AMD's PowerNow technology for servers and market for quite some time, and we've really extended that. And you know, we've been working with you for not only just the power efficiencies of cool core technology and the ability to extend our power management capabilities all the way from the processor and the CPU into the cache but also to make it manageable and also working with you so that you can have the capabilities at the system level to do things like power capping and have that integrated into your management console. And we really like the ability to give all those choices to our customers with you. So Pat, obviously, you know, those eight and 12 core processors and the density that we've been able to put those into servers with the next generation hypertransport and all the memory channels, that's really yielded some industry leading benchmarks. It's really exciting to see our pricing strategy of 2P economics for four-way computing deliver the number one in price performance computing on these industry standard benchmarks. AMD is very excited to have our Opteron 6100 series processors integrated in the most dense four socket blade in the market today with this new launch. What are some of the features that you're excited about? Well, you know, we've got a long tradition of bringing great products to market that are both the sum of our partners' created value and our own. We talked about several of them earlier, but one of the ones that's new that's going to come out with the AMD Blade products is actually something called Flex Fabric that is the next generation of Virtual Connect and involves a, a lot of new capability, not the least of which is integrated down on the system motherboard just like we led the industry in the, the transition to 10 gig with our G6 products. Uh, over a year ago, we're actually leading the industry with the transition to a full storage offload accelerated LOM 10 gig part as well. So we're going to have a you know next generation virtual connect that has a full branded FCOE initiator and iSCSI initiator down on every BL685 and BL465 product. Wow. So I know we've talked a lot about the blades, the world's densest 4P the flex fabric, FCU integration on the 465 and the 685. We didn't stop there though, obviously, for customers that are not procuring blades and are in the traditional rack mount market where we dominate with our 100 series one use and our, our two-way two U products, as well as the 4P4 use like the 585. We also did a, a technology refresh here as well to make sure that all the value of the new Opteron 6100 series made it to those customers as well. 
AMD is very excited about our continued collaboration that we've had in market ever since the original 585 and 145 over six years ago when we first launched Opteron together. And we continue to innovate together and bring out uh, world-class server parts to meet the server needs. And it's just very exciting to continue to partner with the number one server vendor to learn how to innovate and deliver the most value for the data center. Pat, we're really proud of the products that we've created together with G7 and look forward to continuing this in the future. Thank you.